Welcome back folks to another episode of Dom's Fishing Adventures. I really saw wine hook. Oh yeah. <laughs> Two <laughs> Yeah, got him. I'm actually going to steal someone's spot. It's over here. It's actually my sister and brother in law. Told her about the wilding spot. I just want to see if they're catching any. If they are, I'm going to steal it. <laughs> Why not? Oh, she's on. Oh, it's a bubble one. Nice one. Nice spot, soon as we go well for them. I'm trying to get right close up from I want to steal your spot. <laughs> oh, that's giving you curry. Looks like you got a beauty. <laughs> How about that? That's my sister. <laughs> giving a curry. Any colour yet? See, on the eyes on the surface, there he is. Stingray. Yeah. Yeah, they're buggers. Right, so I just set the anchor here on a bit of a sand bed here. Because it's sitting on an anchor, there's no need for a really heavy sinker. Even though I'm in about 16, 17 metres, all I want is to get down to the bottom. So I'm not drifting. It's too windy to drift today. Because, it's, because I had some people finding the spot for me, I'm just going to stay here. <laughs> Got another one. Alright, could be first customer of the day. What have we got here? Beautiful. Nice, beautiful pump wine. It's always a, it's always a pleasure to catch those beautiful wine. And I've got us a few big hooks here too. Just in case there's anything decent that might want to come and join in on the party. Oh, there we go. Oh. Yeah, no, something's on it. They're going here. Oh no. I think it's a stingray. I got a stingray. Oh. They're actually going on the surface. Let's have a look. Oh. It's probably going to need an anchor line now. Oh no, he's got a thing like a hammerhead shark. Hammerhead shark. Hammerhead. There you go. Let's check that out. Hammerhead shark while going for whiting. You believe that? <laughs> I hit the nail on the head on this one. Goodness me. Amazing creature. Oh, right, matey. We'll let you go. Bloody hell. I knew that was going to happen. He's alright. I didn't realise I was recording. Just change rigs. Get something on the bottom. There we go. Oh, that's a good one. There's a flathead there. So you had to change rigs. Make the, uh, the hook line more longer. That's flap 
put it in the water a bit better. I really small winding hooks. Oh. I know it's a um it's a banjo banjo fish. Banjo. Right. <laughs> Mate. How's that? Banjo shark. Man, I'm catching a variety of stuff out here. See you, buddy. Jeez. Not many really whiting, though. Alrighty. Yeah, double. About time. About time. Two fine specimens of the whiting. Yeah, beauty. It's falling pretty tough today, I don't know why. I don't know why. But uh, look, I'm not gonna go for any record keepers today. A handful of whiting. Got uh, got that hammerhead shark. <laughs> that was interesting. Uh, the banjo shark. Sort of just to catch a stingray. She did all right. And uh, yeah, just a matter of having a Saturday out in the morning, getting the feed and enjoying the day. Bad thing is, I did forgot the beers again. I hate that. I'm very thirsty too. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Boom, boom, action. Yeah, they're on. Oh no! Oh no! I got technical malfunction. What the hell happened here? So, I've had a massive wind knot on my line, I had to cut it. So I'm hand lining up now, just to save the rig. I still caught a fish. <laughs> oh, it's a lot of line there, it's about 20 meters. Bit of boom boom here. What have we got here? Another medium sized whiting. It's great. Slowly, slowly, starting to get a nice little bag. Bloody awesome. Yeah, is he on? Yeah, I think he is. I think he is. I think the sinker weighs more than the fish. Yeah, what I tell you? <laughs> Thank God. These small ones. Definitely throw this one back. There you go, mate. Come on, give me some big ones. one that's better I tell you they're a bit bigger because they give you a bit more of a boom boom and it runs through the water too alrighty they're packing up I'm just pulling up anchor drift around I might go and see if I get a couple of squid who knows Oh yeah, <laughs> two. <laughs> yeah, they're not huge. <laughs> no, I don't know. Let him go, that one. That one there can go back too. No, mate, get out of here. I reckon it's a medium-sized flatty. I keep calling the whitings, never catch one. Oh, and there's a good size whiting. So a nice red jig out here. We're not drifting far at all. Just curious, I haven't been here for a while. We've been having storms and the water's it's a bit murky. You can barely see the bottom, but I know I'm in the, in the right spot. The only way you're gonna know you're in the right spot if you catch a couple. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yep. That's good. Go. That's awesome. First cast, jiggy jiggy around. That's a beautiful one. Absolutely. It 
was a beautiful one. He went back in the drink. <laughs> that has never happened to me before. I knew it was going to happen because I am quite blase sometimes and uh... <laughs> oh my god. Oh well. You'd be surprised, he might actually go for that same jig. You just never know. Oh my god. <laughs> that better not be the only squid all day. I doubt it because... Here we go, here we go. Oh yeah. Here we go. See? Oh, he's off. Off. Oh, he's coming right up to me. Oh, there's a good one. Oh, there's a couple there too. Oh, he's running. Oh. Well, that was redemption. That was redemption. It was a good one. Another one came up to it as well. It's got to pop it down over. Yeah, I see him through the water. Oh, he's already on already. Oh, shit. He's on already. Oh, he's taking line. I'm trying to find a rod. Real. That's a good size one. Oh, yeah, good size. Just be careful, I don't want to lose this one. Yeah. Boat's turned around, which I don't like this way. I like fishing on the side, not, not the back. Oh, here we go. Oh. Here we go. How about that for Q? Now I find special here. So I'm lifting the rod up because you always want the tension. It's like normal fish, when you hook up, don't let it go slack. Ooh. Right, let's get him to the surface. There we go, beautiful. Good, good specimen. Oh, happy days. Happy days. Bloody awesome. As I said, I'm just using the one squid jig, one rod. Put the rod hold and just let it wait for it. But you know, if you're getting that tension out line, and you sort of feel, and then you give it a, oh, and then you give it a, I felt a bit of tension, gave it a yank, and on. My God. That's oh, another beauty one. Oops. There we go. Nice. Nice southern calamari. The wind's picked up, so letting more line out. Picked up another one. Feels like the small one I caught before that I lost. Ooh, I think he's just realised it's hooked now. That's what they do, they hold on to it and they're not quite hooked. Barbs haven't set. And you can feel it straight away because it's all the it's, it's like an instant tug and pull 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 yeah it was on the back of the head he's still grabbing onto it yeah i reckon that was the guy that escaped <laughs> remember me mate sorry Yeezo. yeah another another hook up here Oh, and he's just on the on the tentacle. Let's see if I can grab him without too much drama. Oh. Yep. On board. On board. There we go. Really good. I like these sizes. I like them. Oh. I felt it coming, and I. Put the pressure on to push him back in the boat. 
weedy grounds, mind you. Oh my god. Oh, oh yeah, this is a good this is a good size one here. Oh he's put the brakes on. Put the brakes on. There he is. Oh no, it's alright. Right on the back of the head here. Oh that's a good one here. He's probably full of water, look at that. He's gonna explode. Come on mate, do it now. Or we'll forever hold your peace. <laughs> yeah, he's changing colour, he's thinking about it, he's gonna go. No, he's not. What a beauty. I love that when that happens. When you catch a squid, come hurry. It's a good, good one. Come up to the surface. Oh yeah. Oh, there's one. There's another one right here. I don't know if you can sift through the water. Oh. So that's the one I just caught, and there's one right here. I want to see if I can capture him right there. Oh my god, he's a good size. He's a good size. Yeah, got him. Got him. Oh, I know I got him. There's another one behind it, too. There's another one coming right for it. Oh my god. This place is just a, a massive honey hole. Honey hole. Got him. Got another one. <laughs> Hard trying to take the footage and catch him at the same time. That is a fine specimen, that one. Oh, yeah. There we go. Goodness me, I'm glad I moved to this area. It's definitely a honey hole. There's no doubt about it. I reckon I've got a really good haul of good squid. As I said, I'm gonna share the catch. And I should be happy with them because there's some really good, some really good fine specimens there. Yeah, they're still fresh. One, two, three, another one there right here too. Right, so as per usual, I'm just packing up, and this one here is stuck in the rod holder. Another, uh, another good uh, calamari. Another fine specimen. Alrighty. Okay, that's doing me. I'll be heading back home. Just come home from fishing, having some homemade pizza. There you go. Thanks, Mum, done a good job. Mum, I did it. You guys. Oh, my sister did. Oh, look. Whoa, what's that calamari pizza? It's a cal it's a cal Just saved the catch and cook. Here you anyway, go. <laughs> she just saved me doing the catch and cook. Hang on. Oh, my look at that, huh? Well, oh, for you, Dom Since and Mum. Since when you touch calamari? Well, I made it specially for you. Whoa. Hey? Mmm, really nice. I don't know. Must be my birthday. I like this. Fish. You can have some mum? Fish. Taka. Fish. Taka, man. <laughs> fish. Taka. Fish. Taka. The fish. Taco, man.